Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Jimmy here with some Clash Royale like I promised. Oh yeah, so the Mega Crab is kind of cooling down with the videos, so if you guys are sick of them, don't worry, and if you aren't sick of them and you want more, we're sorry. But they'll still be coming out, they'll just be able to cool off. Ooh, my case is all weird. Anyway, we had some very epic battles that were barely wins, and I don't know where it is this is where it starts right here and we are gonna replay these i think it's sideways screen if i'm not mistaken if okay i have to end it get out of there yeah get out of there go to our settings and landscape off okay let's retry that Back to the one zero. These are some very close raids. I got one defeat, but these are some very close raids otherwise. So first off, we I don't even know our strategy. We're gonna double speed it. He places down a witch and a tombstone and he does the glitch. And I already know the glitch. It's where you get your witch stuck and it just keeps spawning skeletons. And right now I'm at the defense because I'm like, uh, what's this guy doing? So I throw some barbarians down and he uh, throws a Velcro down. Gets destroyed pretty easily. Um, he threw a goblin barrel, took it out with arrows. And overall, nothing has successfully worked. And oh, he got an expo up just before I got my, uh, that hut up. Um, he drains that tower, and this is where it starts to get intense around the double elixir time. We haven't really done anything kind of like a hoo hoo hoo. I'm using arrows to destroy his gallon, barrels, barrels, all that good stuff. Um, if you guys are wondering, this is around 1,100 trophy range, so not too high, but since it's getting uh, intense, we're gonna play it in real time, and we just put a mass. We had a thing that where everything is just attacking one building, everything low that could get all taken out by a group of arrows. But of course, it doesn't. And he throws goblin barrel. I use arrows. He doesn't get any. Well, he got a little, but not much. And he is just gonna keep attempting to attack that 500 health. He's just using stuff, and I'm just like, no, 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 no. As long as you try. I'll just defend, and we're gonna double speed it, and eventually I tried to get it all the way down because the crown chest was out, but it didn't work because he placed down a giant, so I couldn't get the three star, but I did get the one star. That was the first to this epic raid. Um, we are gonna show our card layout. We have minions. Oh, excuse me. We have the hut. We have spear goblins. We have the rocket. We have goblins. Excuse me, jeez. Uh, we have arrows, we have barbarians, and we have witches. I took out my giant, I know, guys. I'm a bad person. Now, we got into a draw with someone. And I'm pretty sure he was about to beat me, and I had some clutch victory. I wouldn't say victory, but I didn't lose anything. Um, he was super close, too. So, it's kind of slow in the beginning, like usual. He got a lot of my tower down. He threw a witch in the back, and I was like, yo, bro. I'll do the glitch, and starting off, but sound giant gets aggressive, and I'm like, oh, I don't like that. Um, it was kind of a waste of giant, because my troops just destroyed it, and ooh, he rains down on my parade with some arrows, and we are attacking him. Oh no, he puts down a, uh, not a yeah, a knight on the other side. He gets barely any health. He gets like 200 away. The barbarians, ah, oh, they were so close to getting health, and the spear goblins started to um, got down 300 health. Now both of his towers are partially wounded, and I'm like, okay, I'm gonna easily take this guy out. But he threw a curveball in the game, and he just massed attacked my side, and I was like, yo, bro, this is gonna be super easy. This is where the tables turn. So we are gonna one speed it. He. At right here, I'm like, okay, I'm gonna easily three star this guy. And he puts something down, puts a knight down, and he just swarms my troops. Puts down minions, puts down wizard, just puts down everything. I put down a hut. It's kind of bad. Just everything is not going my way anymore. He gets everything down. This is where the man is stuck. He is throwing everything down. I have really nothing to defend it. Wizards, 
Everything is swarming my side. I'm trying to distract. Ooh, a giant. That's where it all went bad. And I was lucky to defend. There's 20 seconds left in regulation. We're going to speed it up because you guys can see what happened. I tried to stop it before they could get it, but they got my ass side. I can't scratch out the door. Oh, well. And they are just mass attacking my king. And I'm like, oh, no, I'm going to lose. I'm going to lose. And this is where the clutch comes in. I throw so many curveballs in this game. He just, all his troops were demolished. 40 seconds left in uh, overtime. He throws down a giant. Um, what do I do? I put down a goblin hut so we could attack that. In all distractions, he's just, his giant is getting annihilated. Does he get a hit on the king? Yes, but still. 191 health, 17 seconds left. Pekka down, one hit, or maybe two, I don't know how much damage it has. One hit and it's dead. Minions, a couple hits, it's dead. Spear goblins, all that. He's throwing down everything. Four, three, two, one. I throw arrows in case. He throws them too late. And that was an epic clutch draw. Although I should have three-starred him. But he threw a couple curveballs. This next one, where is it? I had a bunch of all these replays. I actually thought I was recording, but I wasn't. And I shoulda, coulda, woulda. Pekka's Playhouse. He says good luck. I'm like, thanks, good luck. We are gonna double speed it like all the others. He throws down a mini dragon, and I'm like, yo, eat my spear goblins. And then he throws down a balloon and a raid spell, which is a perfect combination if he would have timed it perfectly. Which, that was kind of a waste, but he has a, the rage spell as a key role later in this. He plays his goblins, I was like, oh, I don't have arrows ready, so I had to throw down minions, which was pretty good because it didn't get too much health. Minions versus minions. Right now, it's just how every other game starts where not a lot can be done. So, place down barbed, so the mini dragon will get all that. Here, I'll let you watch. He throws down goblin barrel throw down arrows but that was a little later um there's a minion army not minion army skeleton army I threw down minions to defend pretty simplistic 60 seconds left i think this is where oh madness breaks loose he throws down everything the balloon the raid spell it is gonna demolish that thing I don't know if it takes it down fully, it does not, but it demolishes it, and that's where I was like, okay, I have to push and make him feel scared to win this, so I just got all aggressive, and he threw down that, and I'm like, yo, bro, I don't know what to do, and I destroyed it before I could do anything, but... He is just trying to do anything to stop the three star and try and get over to the tower with 391 left. And at this moment, I have a crown chest being waiting to open by any three stars of these, but of course, I can't get three stars, I can only get one star. He throws down a raid spell with the uh, barrel of goblins and just uh, arrows clutch. I think I have one or two more. I have a fail that was pretty sad. One, 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 zero, one, zero. The fail is the three one. Okay. Was this one that good? I don't know. I don't like showing that. I'll show you guys the fail. Because you guys want to see that I'm not all perfect. Okay. Okay. Uh, I don't like this, so we're gonna double speed it. I did not have a good start. I was like, ah, oh, come on. I thought I could swarm one of his things and just demolish it right away. Which is kind of a noob strategy because a lot of people don't know how to defend it. And he got the goblins out. He has the goblin barrel, the prince. He has some good towers, and I do not enjoy them. But you gotta do what you gotta do. And I put a hut in the middle. I thought the Barbarian minion could take down that, but he outsmarted me. Down to 744, and he has a Musketeer out. Gets a shot off, but not more than one. That's the game changer. When I had no elixir, he wasted 400 health of that one tower. 
Right now I have, ooh, the giant. The giant screwed me over right there. That would have been GG for that. But I thought this was going to be GG here. It was. But he destroys nothing. I'm kind of confused how this is going. I thought I didn't get anything. But right now I'm like, okay, I'm going to beat this guy. And he's not going to like it. But he has the perfect strategy. He easily destroys that with everything. And I'm like, oh, come on, come on, come on. I wish I had arrows. But he drains that down way under a thousand. And he has a giant in the making. Gets one hit off him. And I'm like, okay. I got to defend. Overtime. What are we going to do? He has barbarians and minions right now. Put the uh, arrows down. He giggles at me. That, that meanie. And he throws down uh, the goblin barrel. OP. The freaking goblin barrel. OP. Alright. I think. Should I show you guys the uh, win? Ooh. Yeah, I'll show it. To end on a good note. But that was my only loss in a while. And I went up like 200 or 100 around there. Um, this guy had the prince. That's what I was thinking of. He has the expo too. The, he didn't use the expo that effectively. He, I don't think he locked onto any buildings. Which is not what that's for. Yeah. I take out the expo pretty easily. And I still have my towers at mostly full health. And his towers are also... And he is kind of a noob. I don't mean to say it, but he had the prince and the expo, and he couldn't even really do anything. Uh. Okay, so I am just swarming him right now. The knight is never a good idea, because you can just put down a couple of things if it's on your side. Like, even the one elixir... Uh, skeletons that I like to use you can put those down on your side if let's say the knight is on your side it the one zero the, the one elixir gob I can't even speak the one elixir skeletons can just annihilate just distract and he's trying to use the knight with my low-level troops it's qual it's quantity quantity destroys the the healthy the health I don't know what you call it, the the major health troops. It just quantity. Alright, whatever. Before I can lose my mind from speaking wrongly, uh, let's wrap this up. So if you guys enjoyed the video, can you guys give it a thumbs up for Clash Royale? We need some support for Clash Royale. If, uh, if you guys keep wanting it on this channel, just give it massive support. If you guys get like 12 hearts, I'll keep the videos pumping of this. And I'll do some live raids next time. I was just, ugh. I don't know why, but I just didn't record those. And anyway, I'll see you guys next time. Peace out.